एक्सीलेंट एक्सीलेंट सर आई राइज टू अपोज दिस बिल बिकॉज आई थिंक एंड माई पार्टी फील्स that this will weaken the federal structure of this nation right. sir my party has always believed in federalism and our anandpur sahib resolution talked way back in 1973 of giving more powers to the states especially fiscal powers and sir we said that because we believe that in a large country like ours with diverse cultures languages religions this diversity has to be celebrated and we have seen that whenever the center usurps too many powers it's the states that suffer it's the people in the states that suffer and sir we have been the biggest sufferers till today punjab does not have a capital when mrs indira gandhi divided the state into two we were promised chandigarh thereafter even in the rajiv longowal accord we were promised that chandigarh would be given to us but it's very sad that till today punjab punjab is denied denied its rights sir that is why we feel whatever whichever the government governments will come and governments will go we have seen in delhi we've had mrs sheila dixit government for almost 15 years before that there was the, the the bjp government the three chief ministers mrs sushma swaraj saheb singh ji uh, uh, mandala khurana ji we had our differences but and there, there were times the central government was belong to one party and the state government belong to another party but the base is what taught us tolerance tolerance is what mr vajpayee taught us and it is sad today that we are becoming intolerant sir what we are doing today is basically taking us back to the times of mr nehru i would just like to remind the house at that time what was the structure in delhi there was a lieutenant governor and there was municipal corporation for delhi for latians delhi because that's where the seat of power was there was ndmc all the powers were rested in the lg and you would be surprised to know that even when members to the rajya sabha had to be elected there was a separate election which was called electoral college so that people from new delhi could only vote so that they they could elect a member to the rajya sabha but sir then there were 20 lakh people in delhi today there are 2 crore people aspirations have grown and this voice came from the ground that the people of delhi want their voice to be heard and who was heralding it the leaders of jansang balraj madhok later all your leaders were, here, were were fighting for it they were on the roads finally we were given this kind of statehood but your your manifesto said that delhi should be given full statehood but what are they doing with this bill they are taking away what was given i can have my differences with aam aadmi party or any ruling party at, at the center but please do not deny the citizens of delhi their right when they voted it was not just pressing a button they voted to elect people to govern them and today you are denying them that right to be governed so that is why my party strongly opposes it thank you very much thank you narasimha sri k ravindra kumar